been a month since I've been on my own, trying to do what my Aunt May taught me. I really miss her right now, and I don't know how I could do this without her. I made so many mistakes, but even in her last moments, she tried to teach me something. With great power, there must also come a great responsibility. Yeah, being broke sucks, but you can't expect to make too much off delivering pizzas. At least I can afford to pay rent, but it could get pretty lonely in this studio apartment. It's hard to think about Ned and MJ. Maybe I'll tell them everything one day, but for now I'd rather keep them safe and not ruin their normal lives again. Because I know it's the right thing to do. Peter Parker may be forgotten, but the one thing I know in my heart, and that May, my friends, and the people of New York will want me to do, is to be the friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Eddie. Ah. Good morning to you too, Venom. Time's not to tell you not to wake me up like that again. Is everything okay? No. I, I don't feel so good. What's wrong? Feeling under the weather? I can find you something to eat. I really don't know. I feel like a part of me is missing. Coffee? Uh, yes, please. Here's your coffee. Thank you. Can I uh, ask you something? Go ahead. Where did you get that necklace? Oh, uh, some random European guy gave it to me in London, I think. I don't remember most of that trip. Oh, well, uh, it looks good on you. Thanks. It's broken, but I like it this way, to be honest. You know, Peter, you've been coming in here a lot and feel like you're always here for more than just getting coffee. Uh, what, what makes you say that? Well, you show up five days a week, sometimes you show up twice in a day, and some days you show up whenever my friend Ned is here. 
Oh, uh, well, it's because I, I wanted to ask you if you wanted to hang out or get something to eat. How about tonight? Tonight? I mean, uh, yeah, sure, that works. I don't have any plans anyway. Cool. Tonight, then. After I'm done with my shift. 